Hey everyone, this is Frank, and welcome back to Rapture. I know it's been a few months since I've posted up a video or even done a commentary, so I'm going to try and make up to you guys by uh, giving my take on what I consider quite a controversial topic, and that would be the struggles of the new generation. And uh, that seems kind of vague, so I'll try to elaborate on that. Uh, what that means is that the old, the new players uh, can't surpass the veterans that play Bioshock for various reasons. Back in the old days of Bioshock, I used to have a philosophy that I thought was uh, a recycling truth, but it ended at some point. And was that uh, whenever old players leave Bioshock, new players should come up and take their place as, you know, the top dogs, the quote-unquote elite players. And that happened for quite some time, but it hasn't been until recently, within like uh, a year and a half to two years, that this hasn't been happening. Uh, new players haven't been showing up and taking up the throne of the veterans. It's just, just been the veterans playing, and which, it, this is disconcerting. Because I think uh, Bioshock 2 is a small community game and that competition should be one of its main reasons of uh, staying alive other than its unique uh, ideas for multiplayer. And I have a list of reasons as to why I think the community isn't as competitive or as good as it used to be. And one of the main causes is the lack of effort from the new players. Uh, it just seems that no one wants to become a better player. All they want to do is just goof around. Which is fine. If you like that, that's fine. But I know there are some players that are quite competitive, but they aren't thriving because there isn't a competitive environment. People have, uh, I think, gone into a state of casual gaming where instead of becoming competitive, they just go, that was a cool game there, huh? And it's this kind of mentality uh, that I think prohibits the new players from becoming better. They just think that by not doing anything and by watching other people, they'll just become better. They don't. They don't uh, try to push themselves to become better players. And it's that kind of mentality for the Bioshock 2 community that is currently there that I don't think anything productive is really going to happen. No one uh, seems to want to do anything. And another thing, uh, there aren't any rivalries anymore. I remember back in the old days of Bioshock, there used to be a fair amount of rivalries that helped spice things up, which kept the game alive longer. And the reason I think there aren't enough rivalries is because uh, the scales have tipped between the amount of good respectable players and the amount of trash players. I think it's leaning more towards one side and not the other. So that there aren't, there isn't as much competition because the skill gap between the levels is too big to promote any type of like a competitive environment. So uh, I think there are ways to mediate this problem. I think that if uh, new generation put forth more effort to actually become better players, that the game could uh, live on longer. Although I'm guessing that Bioshock will live on for quite a long time, it just won't be as fun for the old players just because there, there isn't really much competition anymore in the game. So if any of you new players are listening to this, um, I don't mean to be bashing on any of you, I'm just stating a problem that I think's been here for quite some time. I'm not uh, trashing on the skill level of players as well, I'm just stating what I think should be known. It's just that uh, there aren't many new players coming back into Rapture, and there are more old players staying. But uh, the new players that are there haven't really been making a difference in the community, which I think uh, should be the opposite of what's happening. I think the new players should be the ones striving for change and trying to uh, make a difference in the community. Uh, I know I sound like a complete arrogant jackass whenever I talk, or any time I do this. So hopefully you guys have uh, slightly enjoyed my commentary on what I think is uh, quite relevant in the game. 
So, I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay, although it was not. Talk to you guys later.